How's it hanging, ladies and gentlemen? This is Jeff with iDownload Blog. Let's chit chat about iEagle Eye, a jailbreak tweak that allows you to get a lot more out of the photos that you find in mobile Safari. For instance, all these options here, you can invoke using iEagle Eye. You can pull up EXIF data, you can have the copy of the image URL, you can open a new tab, you have these services down here, you can open Google Images, 10i, EXIF data, image ops, lots of different things you can do with iEagle Eye. And I'm gonna show you how this works here. I have iDownload blog open right now. There is a particular image of the AR drone. I'm gonna just tap and hold on that image. You have the familiar options there, but then you have these new options, such as copy image URL, open image in new tab, Google Images, 10i, image ops, etc. So I'm gonna Google image search on that particular image. And as you can see, it pulls up the Google image page with some relevant data on that. Now, if I tap and hold again, we can also do some other things like open the image in a new tab, just like that. So it opens the image in a brand new tab quickly and easily. You can copy the image URL, which is really nice because that functionality obviously isn't built into the stock browser by default. So I can do that and go to that particular URL if I choose to do so. Then there's also things like 10 which allows you to search uh, do a reverse search on the image to find other images, um, host it elsewhere. Of course, they didn't pull up any on that particular search. Let's try image ops. And this will really allow you to do a lot of different things. If you haven't checked this website out, you might want to do that. It's really cool. You can pull up EXIF data right there. So I just tap on EXIF slash GPS and it pulls up any data that is embedded into that image. Also it tells you if the image has been compressed all that jazz. So folks, this is iEagle Eye. It's not out just yet, but it should be out on the Cydia store in the near future. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownload Blog.